Hi loves, it's Shonda, how are you? And welcome to Shonda Says. Today is Tuesday, normally I record on Mondays, but yesterday it was impossible for me to record. With that being said, I am here right now. Now today is not a pink room video, that will be for tomorrow. And I'm going to be discussing something very sexy tomorrow. You guys know once you enter through that pink door, you never know what you're going to get. So make sure you're here with me tomorrow regarding the pink room. But today is a little obscure subject matter. Uh, I want to talk to you, to everyone out there that's a parent. If you are a parent, I need your comments more than ever this week. And this subject was brought up by just me being out and about. Now, again, if you guys know me, I say this all the time, I'm old school. And my thoughts and, and how I think about certain things, I'm very old-fashioned about things. So even when it comes to parenting, I will tell you I'm old school all the way. And with that being said, today I saw a bunch of little kids walking and they were all on their own. And I always make comments here and there. And my sister chuckles at me because she says, Shauna, this is what city kids do. It's nothing for them to be outside by themselves. This is how they, you know, this is what it is here. This is how city kids are. There, a lot of them are latchkey kids. They're off on their own. They have to basically hold themselves down where their moms are at work. And believe me, I understand that. I get that. I was a mom at 15. I was, I've was. i been raising a child for many years, so I understand that. But what brings up the subject is this. Because we live in a day and time now that parents have to be out of the home, does that mean that we let our kids just do and act a certain way? Like, I'm still, like, I'm one of those moms that I have to walk my kid to the bus stop. I have to see them physically get on the bus. You know, I don't, um, I don't like seeing a parent where their kids are walking behind them and I'm like feet in, feet in front of you, 10 feet in front of you, and you're lagging behind me. I need to see my children at all times. I don't allow my kids to run around in the store. They weren't allowed to do that. My daughter wasn't allowed to do that. Um, when we're in a restaurant, you have to sit down. You are, you are not allowed to stand up and look around or go walking around the restaurant disturbing other customers while they're eating. And I see so much of parenting that's very laid back and lackadaisical, I guess. And I have to be honest, the old school Shonda doesn't care for it. I hate it. I think that children should be taught boundaries very, very early. Very, very early. And I think that they're capable of learning boundaries very, very early. And, you know, I always wanted, like my mom did, you know, my mom's kids were known for their manners, being well-spoken and being uh, well-behaved. Like, I'm brought up in that era where it just took a look. You see that look? Like, Okay, you know what I'm talking about. And also, too, like, and I raise my kids the same way. Like, if there's adults in the room and we're talking, you're not allowed in the room. You have to leave the room because it's adults here and you're not getting all up in the business. I wasn't allowed to comment on my parents' conversations or I would be tasting salt in my mouth from the blood. <laughs> you know, I had to be a child and stay in a child's place at all times. And I don't know if kids today have that um, have that about them. Even with with me, like my little one, he'll come in and he knows not to have his hat on in the house. Like I'm old school. When you come in my door, you have to take your hat off. You cannot be walking around with a ball cap in my house. And you know, my dad taught me that, and I still hold to that. But do you think I'm being too old fashioned in my thoughts? Like. Am I being too old-fashioned and say, you know, kids need to be kids, let them express themselves, which I'm all for that, but I just think that kids today, we need boundaries. They need to know that an adult means a respect position. I think a lot of children don't respect adults the way they should. Now, there's a lot of adults that don't deserve respect. And of course, you know, we want to teach our kids, you know, the difference between a great adult and someone that's questionable. But am I wrong in my thinking? Am I too old-fashioned for today? Gotta give me your comments on it. It's all about parenting today, but tomorrow, you know how, how it goes down in the pink room. 
I don't know why my video keeps fading, but that's what I'm doing with my fingers. But until tomorrow, I love you guys. Remember, you can follow me on Twitter at Shonda Says. Email me with any comments or uh, suggestions at ShondaSays1 at gmail.com. And you can find Shonda Style on ShondaFreeman.com. I'm wearing my white mock wrap dress today. So if you go on, you can see that there. And I love you. And we'll talk. We'll see you tomorrow. Be ready to be pinked out tomorrow. Bye, guys.